Hello there my wonderful beautiful watchers and welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So today I thought we were gonna do something special. We're gonna see what the fuck these uh, screws do when you give them uh, to Fur uh, Pura here. As you remember she wanted the ancient materials in order to upgrade my Shika slate I think it was I don't know what that means maybe I can take more pictures or something like that probably something stupid but uh, let's uh, see now then in exchange for those ancient materials I'll power up a rune on your Shika slate Ooh, even better I'm game so which rune do you want to power up I want stasis Stasis power up time. Yahoo! For that I need three ancient cores. Yes? I don't have that. Fuck. I'm barely scraping by as is. Hint hint. So which rune do you want to power up? Uh, Shika sensor? Maybe that takes something else. Ancient screws. Yes, I have that. Three ancient screws and a cute snap. Here I go. Snap. Hey ho, got it! Okay then, Shika sensor upgrade underway. Guidance stone lock removed. Ooh. Now let's do this thing. I just need to see if I can see myself. There we go. Now let's do this thing. I have a Christmas mug, drink my coffee in the middle of, uh, in the middle of spring because I don't have, <laughs> have any other clean cups. I seriously need to buy some mugs for uh, or cups or whatever, what the fuck ever you want to call them. Big ones like this that are almost as big as my head. I need more of those that are that aren't uh, fucking Christmas themed. Oh, there we go. Searching for compendium items. If your sensor has been augmented to search things, uh, search for other things other than shrines, it will react when you are close to the thing you have set to it to look for. Head in the direction where the reaction is strongest, and you should be able to find the thing you're looking for. Okay, that's pretty nice actually. But I'm gonna keep it for uh, the fucking uh, what's it called. Uh, the shrines because man that has been a huge help for me. Oh, by the way guys, we have uh, cleared a couple more shrines So now we have 10 spirit orbs total and I discovered what the thing uh, You got uh, Mifas grace that was the item. I discovered what uh, that uh, did too just quite. So if you don't mind, how about showing Simon that spiffy Shika sensor plus later? Uh, later. Uh, apparently, once you die, or at least once your health goes down to zero, uh, it will automatically heal you and then give you about four hearts, I believe it was, uh, extra outside of your uh, maximum health. And after that, it takes about 23 in-game minutes for it to uh, charge up again. Then you will be able to use it again. So it's infinite. Damn, that's a good thing if you ask me. I've got a lot of use for it. I can tell you that much. Uh, yes. Uh, oh, I can only... Upgrade this. Remote bomb power up um, uh, three ancient chats. Yes, I have that. Snap! Snap! I wonder if that even heard on the in the fucking audio. It seems like it. I have my audio program running on the second screen here. Ah. I've been doing a bit much since the last time we uh, I recorded this episode, which has been about 30 minutes since uh, last time, because um, I need to record the episodes in one huge chunk in order to, uh, uh, what's it called, uh, edit them and then get, uh, I need about half a day editing those and then half a day 
rendering those. Yeah, my computer is not that super quick with this. Uh, wait a second. Powered up bombs now have a stronger blast and they recharge faster. The force of the blast can damage monsters or destroy objects. There are round and cube bombs, so use whichever best fits the situation. Okay. Um, but uh, I need to uh, keep on. So I need half day to render. And while it renders, my software that I use for editing can't run any I can't run anything else on the computer while it's rendering because th this program takes up so much of the CPU of the computer that you just can't do anything else because if you do the fucking it just stops rendering in the middle of everything and doesn't continue after that so then you have to restart it and it takes a couple of hours for each episode to render completely it's, uh, it's a huge pain in the ass but that's just how it is so that's why i need to uh, uh record these in chunks because if i didn't i needed to do the episode edit it then render it and then I could barely could uh, record anything else on that <laughs> on the same day. So I, I need to do this. This is the only way that works for me right now, as it is with work and everything. Because I work in the morning <laughs> often, and I need to go to bed pretty early in order to <laughs> even keep up with the entire day. Uh, day. Are you gonna tell me that you want to see the? Okay, he didn't want to see the bombs explode even bigger. Okay, so you can see that I have a charge for uh, Mifa's Grace right under the uh, controls where you can see you can show the bomb, you can show the shield, and you can show the uh, weapon you have. So under that you can see the elephant or uh, Varuta as it's called in the game. So that, uh, and you can see times one next to it. That means that I have one charge for this. It doesn't charge uh, more than one. You uh, Okay, we're gonna see what he wants. You've acquired a Chica sensor plus. That should really come in handy. With that, you can sense things that you've captured with your camera. Okay, nice. That's actually pretty nice. Explaining the want to justice. Why not try by learning? Let's give it a shot, so to speak. Let's see here. First, go take a picture of the sun's room with the camera. There is one behind the lab, but I picked that up earlier. Okay, I need. Let's see if there is one. I was just behind here and picked it up. Yes. I can't take a picture of it. It's not here anymore. Oh, what's this? Farmer's pitchfork. I don't need that. I dropped the bomb. I dropped the bomb, bitch. Okay, so uh, who cares? I'll take a uh, picture of a sun. Ooh, I wonder if I can go up here. Okay, so in this episode, what we're attempting to do is just get to the next. Uh, uh, stage, which would be whichever we choose to be. I bel I think I want to choose the. Oh, her diary. Uh, the, the, uh, research diary for anti aging rune classified for Fura's eyes only. Yeah, I'll read. Date. Work has finally begun on my anti-aging rune. If all goes to plan, I believe it will effectively reverse the, age, reverse the aging process. Well, that's nice. This technology will enable us to make retired warriors young again, thereby strengthening the Hyrulean army. When Calamity Ganon inevitably returns, we'll be ready. Our offense will be solid and our defense impenetrable. The need for this uh, tech pains me, but I truly hope to use it to attain everlasting peace for all. Next page. Date. Uh, the beta version of my anti-aging rune is complete. I have already added it to the sheet slate I made for myself. Since I am to be the test subject of this experiment, Simon booted up the rune and directed its rays at my body. 
Uh, after 20 seconds of exposure, I felt extreme fatigue and broke into a fever, forcing us to cease the experiment. Unable to stay awake, I went to bed immediately. Tomorrow I will try to figure out what went Avery. Anti-aging experiment trial day 2. My extreme full body fatigue has slightly improved, for which I am grateful. Still, I do not recognize the face in my mirror. My hair is thick again and f uh, floor length. My wrinkles once deep as trenches have vanished without a trace. It seems that the, uh, the anti-aging anti -aging effect works. However, I did not expect the reversal to happen so frighteningly fast. This morning I kicked Simon awake and had him run a full physical exam on me. My height, weight, vision, bone, dens bone density, heart, blood, we tested everything we could, pushing our facility to its limits. Our discoveries were startling. My results were typ typical of Sheikah woman in her early 50s. Hmm, nice, it worked for her. In other words, I reversed my age by more than 70 years in a single night. Holy fuck, they grow to be that old? Wait. I reversed my age by more than 70 years. And she was 50 in the experiment. That means she was 102 years old? 120. What the fuck? Man, they're old as shit. Holy fuck. I can only hope I do not awaken to find I have the body of a newborn baby. Okay, uh, we don't need to read this anymore. Okay, so we're gonna teleport as close to... Because I believe... Woodland Tower. What? I can teleport close to that. Oh wait, is that the fucking tower that I tried to climb earlier? Well, let's travel here. Okay, oh fucking hell. Mistake, I wasn't gonna travel here. I was planning to travel to... Kakarika village a bit uh, just to get uh, the upgrades on my health and everything like that so I apologize for that I clicked the wrong thing I didn't think sorry please excuse me I don't even know if that's even gonna pick up on this it seems like it it's, it's very interesting to have the audio playing next to you I, I'm a bit fascinated by it I'm gonna try to attempt to record some music with a friend later on today. See if that works. Okay, let's go to Kakariko Village. Over here. Hateno Village. Sora's Domain. Kakariko Village. There we go. Travel 2. Oh man. Anybody, anybody else that me that just loves a cup of coffee any time of the day, just coffee oh man this is sweden's actually I, that would be a pretty interesting i wonder if sweden uh, what the most popular drink here in sweden is i would believe it is coffee it's even coffee or uh, coke zero i don't know why i i hate i hate anything except the original coca cola but uh, zero is very popular actually. I don't really know why. E either that or Pepsi. Pepsi is the shit around here. If you go to someone on uh, say the street or something like that and ask them uh, what sort of uh, cola do you usually drink? They will either say Coke, normal, Coke Zero or Pepsi. It's one of those. That's as easily... Uh, as it can be. Okay, pick up the apples and now let's see where is that? There it is. Is that a cuckoo? Hi, cuckoo. I wonder if I. Oh, we should try that. We should try to see if <laughs> when I beat the shit out of it, if it's like Ocarina of Time that it just comes down an army to kill you. You who conquer the shrines and claim the spirit orbs in exchange for four spirit orb, I will amplify your being. Okay, so it doesn't increase. Okay, I'll take a heart container. Yes. And next I'll take... Uh, 
Uh, and next I'll take some stamina. Because I feel like I need to get some more stamina in me. I have six hearts now. That's pretty nice. Stamina vessel. I wonder what they are gonna look like. That's pretty nice looking actually. I bet they took the design for Skyward Sword with the stamina fruit. It looks like that, right? Yeah, I think it looks like that. Oh, so you get the second ring outside of that. Nice. Let's see. Oh, that's much better. Doesn't do that much difference, but the difference is still nice. Okay, so... Oh, by the way, guys, uh, you can see here the map has been expanded a bit because uh, earlier I only had the Great Plateau, but now I have Lanaru, Lanaru, what the fuck it's called, uh, can be seen on the map too. That's because I conquered a tower there. Uh, you know those giant towers that uh, woke up every shrine on the Great Plateau that we did. That's because every time you go up those towers, there is a Sheikah Slate uh, slot there. If you put it in there, you get the map and yeah, it just shows you everything. That's uh, pretty nice. So we should try to get the Woodland uh, Tower too. We're gonna try that. And at the same time, we're gonna attempt to climb up the mountain to get to the, to, to the Goron village. I'm still a bit surprised that we haven't met any other uh, any other uh, races except for Sora. Okay, there's the Gorum we met in Sora's domain, but that doesn't really count. Uh, but uh, I feel like if we just go this way, we're gonna see a Goron eventually. So okay, uh, now we just need some guidance. Uh, what the fuck? Uh, I'm sorry. I have to move a bit because the mic is the mic is so mic mic. What the fuck is it called? The microphone is so big that I can't really see in front of it completely. So okay. Uh, what the fuck? Can I put down any moving more? Uh, delete this pin. Uh, where the fuck did I put pins now again? Okay. And, uh, and that will do. Okay, so it's this way. I can climb this. Because I have more stamina now, <laughs> that will help. Okay. Uh, was there anything else I did while uh, when I didn't record? Mm, I don't think there was. Okay, I uh, met a whole, uh, a huge uh, part of uh, oh, what's it called? Uh, a huge mob of uh, uh, skeletal moblins. You know those big, big guys that we tried to blow up on uh, our way to one of the towers, and they're not that tough. They take about two hits from a sword. Uh, to break apart and then one hit to the head uh, or skull to break them completely. Uh, I don't want to waste too much. Uh, don't I have anything? Okay, by the way, I have uh, cooked up. Look at this hearty meat and mushroom skewer. skewer. Full recovery plus one heart. The recipe for this, anyone who plays this game outside of this, the recipe is prime meat and one hearty... Uh, hearty radish? No. Oh, uh, yes, I remember now. Uh, one prime meat and one hearty uh, truffle. That's the recipe for this. Okay, so do I have any... Okay, I'm... I'm gonna need to use this just to get up here. <laughs> Would have been so funny if I just jumped all the way and just wasted my effort anyway. What the fuck? Oh, nice. But I don't care about you. Go away. 
Where did Flint go? God damn it. Oh, fucking hell. You think you can beat me? Forget this, bitch. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, damn, that took a lot of health. Uh, let's see. Do I have anything I can just... Uh, steamed fish, sure. Oh, I have a meat skewer. Take that. Uh, no way. That's way too much health. There we go. This will do. And I get some movement, uh, movement speed too. Oh. How do I pick up this? Uh, I don't care really. I love it. Fucking hell. As I uh, told you earlier, this is my absolute favorite weapon in this game so far. Where did it go? There it is. Okay, I hit it too close to the ground. Okay, so I've been down this path before. Actually, I wasn't recording when I did. But this is part of the way I took to get... Uh, for ads. We're on the we're on the right path at least. We're on the way to the mountain. He is fucking annoying as hell. So let's do this. Get over here, bitch. I love the combat now that I've learned a bit more about it. Come on, hit me, hit me, hit me. <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, let's see, what do I pick? Yeah, we have another one. Damn, that hurt. Holy shit, okay, there you go. Th that's how uh, Mifa's grace works. Okay, uh, let's equip a new shield. Take this. Why did you throw your weapon, you fucking stupid son of a bitch? Yeah, damn, that was the most stupid NPC uh, mob I ever encountered in this game so far. What? I can't carry anymore? Fuck this then. That's a moblin arm, by the way. It's, just, it's as big as my entire body. The moblins in this game are big. Okay, let's see if this, uh, this guy is any challenge. Oh, fucking hell, I see an ice keys. I hate ice keys. They're so goddamn annoying. God damn you. Oh fucking hell, he almost jumped down on his own. Fuck you. Just die already. Give me those arrows, give me arrows, give me arrows. Fuck you. Come on, come on, come on. Eat this. There you go, Link. Back to health. And... Catch the boomerang. God damn it. Fuck, I focused on something else. That was a mistake. That was my mistake. Shouldn't underestimate this guy. It's pretty tough, actually. Take a two out. Get over here. Here we go. And now we do this. Go. 
arrow, knocked his spear out of the way. And then we take it. And. God damn it. There we go. Fucking did it. I love Lysalphos, by the way. They they give you so much shit. So quickly. Okay. I've wasted a lot of time doing this. I'm gonna need to shorten it a bit. I'm sorry for that, guys. I am actually sorry for that. Legitimately. I still have no arrows. Fuck you, I hate keyses. Okay. As long as I just catch him now, I should be fine. God damn it, I'm not gonna make it. God damn it. Okay, uh, just equip this. Oh damn! That took him down very fast. Oh, by the way, guys, uh, I've noticed that. I don't know if it's just me that has bad luck or something like that, but I can't get anything from Keyses. Uh, Keyses? Why do I see Keyses? They're not Keyses, they're Wiz robes. Uh, I can't get anything from them. I don't know if it's just me that has super bad luck or if they just don't drop anything at all. But I'm actually pretty curious if they... Because I feel like they should drop something at least. Maybe not something that you can make a potion out of or something like that, but at least give me something that I can make clothes into. Because, I mean, they, they wear clothes. They should be able to drop, like, cloths or something like that. Like in... Uh, what's it called? Uh, Hyrule Warriors. They, they drop shit like that there, right? I think so, at least. I believe they do. I don't remember fully. It's been a while since I've played that game, actually. Okay, so where is Death Mountain from here? Okay, we're gonna wait with the fucking tower. Oh, by the way, uh, down there's a moblin if you don't remember what it looks like. Fucking huge is that shit. Okay, I feel like we're pretty close to Death Mountain. It should be around this. Yeah, it's definitely around this. That smoke of cloud... Uh, that uh, cloud of smoke, you can't... You can't... Uh, if you're a Zelda fan... You just can't uh, misplace that for anything else in uh, the entire series. You know that if you see a ring of smoke and you're playing a Zelda game, you know that's Death Mountain. That's just the, how it is. So, let's see if we can't get up there pretty quickly. Should be able to... Oh, fuck! I didn't uh, notice this. Okay, eat this. Fuck, the temperatures are out of control. Uh, do you have anything to help me with this? I don't think so. God damn it. Am I gonna die? Oh, fucking hell, these are burning. That's not good. These are burning too. Or if I pick them, uh, put them out, do they just begin to burn then? Uh, equip this. Maybe that's what make me burn. Okay, probably not. Uh, equip some other clothes other than freeze. Uh, freeze shit. Ah, god damn it. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Heat resistance. Oh, fucking hell, fucking hell. No wonder I'm burning up. God damn it. I am so gonna die. I am so... So fucking gonna die. Okay, I appear to be safe here. Yeah, I was too close to the lava, that was the problem. Okay, my fucking screen timed out for a second. Okay, so... Where is it? There, over, up there is that mountain. Okay, so let's see, let's go this way. Oh, no, 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 no lava for me, no lava for Link. Link doesn't like lava. Neither do I. 
seriously hope that I get a tunic or something like that for heat soon. I am right on the edge to be burned as soon as heat resistance is ending. Yes, I am right on the edge as you can see on the Celsius. I like by the way how it in the American version it's Fahrenheit but in the European version the one I'm playing it's Celsius. That's an that's not really something that you uh, think about but it is a really nice touch. Oh fuck yeah, we're gonna kill you. Okay. That was simple. Do I go down there to get the shit? Nah. Okay, I'm gonna skip forward a bit in this episode because I feel like this is not something that interests you guys. So I'm gonna skip ahead a bit if I haven't already. And we'll... Uh, fucking hell, he breathes fire. Stop breathing fire already! Die, bitch. Okay, guys. We're back. For a little while, we're back. Uh, I think I have discovered a way to get to the tower very easily without having to battle those guys. It's not that I'm coward or anything, it's just that I I feel like this is the way I wanna do it right now because I don't have any arrows or anything like that and I know there's a fire we throw down there and he is fucking annoying once he gets, uh, once he sees you. So I'm gonna attempt to fly, uh, to glide down there because the only way I didn't do it before, I believe, was that I wasn't high enough and that I didn't have reco uh, stamina recovery. Now I have both. So let's just attempt this. This should work. This should definitely work. So if I can just land on the top immediately, that means I don't have to battle every single one that's there. And don't worry guys, you won't have to watch me repeat all the way up because I'm gonna do that separately so you don't have to so don't, you don't have to worry about me wasting all of the episodes time just on that because I feel like I've been misusing the episodes in that way yeah this worked great I didn't even need to use any stamina recovery items which I thought I would Shika Tower activated. And now you will see the cutscene. This is how this cutscene works. Just pan out and show you a bit of what you get on the map. And you also activate the tower so you can teleport there. Scanning area. And the tier. Anybody, anyone else who thinks that's supposed to be a tier? I feel like that's supposed to be it here. I mean, it's the Sheikah eye and then uh, there comes a drop. Of course, that's gonna be the tier. And now we have the area for this. Oh, okay. Regional map extracted. Whoa, is that supposed to be a forest? No, that can't be a forest, right? Can it? I have no idea. No, that has to be the mountain area or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, that has to be. Oh, maybe not. Okay, there's a bit of forestry here. Okay, we're gonna. I'm gonna see you guys in one second. And... Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm so sorry for this, but I'm gonna have to end the episode there. Because I don't have the room or something or anything to keep on going right now. But... I got a tip from my pal, that uh, from my best friend actually, that there is a way to get uh, up on t uh, Death Mountain. So I actually tried to change direction and go for the wind one. So we'll see which one I go for. Most likely I'm going for the Death Mountain one. But I will see you guys then. And don't forget, if life puts up a wall in your way, like not knowing how to fucking progress, just smash right through it and keep on going, quicken out.
Thank you.